Hello you absolute legends, welcome back to the channel. We're starting the video today at Sidley Drive. Uh, we are looking at the Armstrong Sidley Owners Club and they're here at the Baston Classic Car Show 2023 and they are such a great turnout. In this video then we're going to take a look at all the Armstrong Sidleys that have uh, come out for the day and had their day here at Baston Classic Car Show. We've got a beautiful 234 here, that is Beautiful sapphire in cream. Excellent, beautiful car. I've had a chat with the owners as well. They're lovely people. And actually, they were having a quick look at my Armstrong Sidley Lancaster when it was originally up for sale and uh, missed out. I pipped them to the post. Never seen another one in the metal. A 1951 Armstrong Sidley Lancaster. This one originally supplied uh, as for the UK market, uh, it would have been uh, green in colour and then was painted red. It uh, belongs to a great guy who's told me lots of information about my Lancaster and he's driven it all the way from the Netherlands. Um, and as we know, we've got the, the four, haven't we? We've got the Hurricane, the Lancaster, the Typhoon and the Whitley. Here is a Hurricane then on display. 1952 Hurricane, again, would have originally been black in colour. I uh, had a chat with the owner, it was then painted red and then following that uh, ended up in this fetching green colour. This is a Typhoon. I had a uh, look at one of these. In fact, I had a look at this exact car a little while ago when it was for sale on eBay earlier last year. It had been modified a little bit, but uh, it is beautiful. We've got the vinyl roof and it's been fully retrimmed. And you can see it's a two-door version as opposed to the four-door. Uh, and the difference, I suppose, between the Whitley uh, and the Typhoon is the vinyl roof and the, uh, and, and the uh, style at the back. You've got the different openers. Look at that. What a beautiful sight, all these sphinxes. And then to complete the set of four, we've got a Whitley here, beautiful in the black. And this is the most common Armstrong Sidley from the four still on the road. We have got here then a 1953 Whitley. Beautiful, named after the uh, medium bomber made by the Armstrong Whitworth aircraft. Beautiful. Uh, here we've got a Star Sapphire. This is a 1960 model, this one. And uh, looking beautiful in the two-tone cream and black. You can see the difference as well between the post-war cars, still a, a, a post-war era, but into the 1960s. Um, much more different, you've got these overriders at the back, you've got the uh, bits and pieces on the rear wheel, and uh, beautiful to see all these sphinxes in one place. And you can see a difference as well between sort of the post-war cars and the 1960s sphinx. Actually got a full sphinx here, as opposed to just a normal sphinx head. Um, absolutely beautiful these, uh, stunning. There's so many more uh, Sidleys here, uh, things I've not seen before actually. We've got here a, oh, I don't know, 12 horsepower maybe? Let's have a quick look. It's a 20 horsepower pre-war Armstrong Sidley, beautiful. Got a Rover here with the club for some reason. Uh, but I've had a chat with quite a few people from the Armstrong Sidley Owners Club today and what a great bunch of people that they are. This is the team from the Armstrong Sidley Heritage Trust. And look at all these trophies, brilliant, fantastic. Look at all these super trophies, including a uh, post-war, brilliant, they're deciding all their results there. This is beautiful, look at all these trophies, absolutely fantastic, great, great result. This is a 12 horsepower Tora. 1934 in a fetching blue. This is an honest car. Beautiful, this absolutely lovely. Uh, 1939 Armstrong Sidley 16 in this dark blue. And this is an Alvis uh, related to the Armstrong Sidley mark, of course. Beautiful in there. Let's have a poke about in there. Fantastic, nice to see we've got the original leather seats and being the limo edition, this one. You can roll the window up and have a look. Have a look at everything. Here we go, what's this? This is a Armstrong Sidley drop top. Having a look. Excellent, 12 horsepower sports tourer. Excellent. Here's another Star Sapphire. This one. A 1955 Sapphire 326, there's another 
three two three, three two four. It's a three two six. Wonderful, this lovely two tone again. A lot of the cars you'll see are two tone. You've got the ivory and the black, and inside this stunning, stunning, lovely patinated leather. Inside, we've got another 326. This one, a star sapphire in red and cream. 17 horsepower sports tourer. And another Hurricane by the looks of things. This one, the 18 horsepower Hurricane, not the 16 horsepower edition. You can tell because you've got not got a split grill. 16 horsepower, early split grill. This would be a 52, 53. Let's have a quick look. Yeah, 53 uh, on the Hurricane there. <laughs> Fantastic, absolutely beautiful. Lovely stuff. Seeing a lovely hurricane there got a star sapphire here excellent again beautiful two-tone <laughs> and a long 15 these are blooming rare now a long old long 15 old pre-war followed by delilah this is a siddley special six she's for sale at the moment delilah 1934 this one and you can tell because you've got your overriders here on your wheel arch and looking inside as well you've got all these bits and pieces wilson pre-select gearbox on the majority of these including a crash box this one a 33 12 horsepower finished in this beautiful two-tone gray and blue absolutely lovely right let's have a look around here then what else have we got we've got some more Two, three, sixes. Uh, let's take a look at this. We've got a 1960 star here. And a beautiful in there as well. This is a beautiful two-tone, sort of gold and then like a fawn. And of course, you would get Armstrong Siddleys in your, in your black from factory. You would get a maroon, fawn, and a, a lovely jewel green as well. Not really many other colours, to be honest with you. Uh, it's why a lot of them have been sort of painted over the years 1937 i would suggest yeah 1937 siddley special this would be a 13 or 15 horsepower absolutely stunning you've got another 236 sapphire here this is the drop top version here's one of my favorites look at this absolutely beautiful sapphire this in the two-tone very similar to what Josh has got, a 346 Sapphire, 54, 1954 this one. You've got the single grill. A beautiful tour over here as well in green. Let's have a look at this tour. Absolutely beautiful. Uh, it's a Siddeley special. Quite a few of these here today as well, I'm surprised. Only one Lancaster though. A couple of Hurricanes, Typhoon. Excellent. Let's take a look at this. Now this has got a connection with the Lee Francis, I believe. What is this? I thought it was a Lee Francis, Peter. 1928. My other car is an Armstrong Sidley. So uh, there should have been an Armstrong Sidley here by the sounds of things. He's an honorary member of the, of the club. And I've not seen one of these for a very long time this is a sapphire automatic excellent let's take a look in there fantastic three four six sapphire fantastic right let's take a look then back at that uh, lancaster before we leave and have a quick poke around that Lancaster and have a look at the differences as well because my Lancaster if you have not seen it on the channel is a 16 horsepower this is an 18 horsepower there's quite a few differences as well including the interior is totally different um, there's a bench seat in here we've got sunshine roof uh, same as mine I must admit I've never opened mine but the bonnet opening is totally different and the mirrors is totally different as well and you'd also get the 18 badge on the front 
Fair play to the Armstrong Sidley Owners Club who have come out in absolute force today. I've just gone around and had a bit of a chat about some of these cars. I'm sure I've not got all the facts and figures right, but it's so good to see. And one of my favorite things is definitely seeing the Lancaster, the Hurricane, the Typhoon, and the Whitley all in one place here at Baston Classic Car Show. If you enjoyed the video, uh, like please. Uh, thumbs up really does help. If you haven't already subscribed to the channel, please do. And I will uh, finish the video looking at this beautiful 18 horsepower uh, 1951 Lancaster. Till next time, have a great day, whatever you're getting up to. Take care and goodbye.